Justin Kramer, president of Pile Financial Services. So today what we want to think about is arguably the most complex and difficult piece of the new tax law. The QBI deduction or the Qualified Business Income Deduction, also known as 199A. Here's what we need to know about it. If you're a business owner that has passed through income, typically those would be LLCs, S corporations, partnerships, things of that nature. If your income is less than $300,000, you are potentially eligible for the full 20% deduction. Now, a lot's been said about that applies to certain professions and not, but that's simply not true. There's a phase out range from three to $400,000. And again, remember, if you are a pass-through entity, your ability to manage what your net business income is, is directly related to whether or not you're eligible for the deduction. So some advanced planning strategies we use is to make sure that things are classified correctly as a business expense, if it's a business expense, and do some advanced planning techniques to make sure that we can keep the income on paper at the appropriate range so that you may be potentially eligible for a 20% deduction off of your net business income. Again, I've talked with tax attorneys, CPAs around the country. This, without question, is the most difficult legislative piece of tax law that's currently in place, and it requires a team of professionals to understand and to make any adjustments. But here's the bottom line. If you're a business owner and you have passed through business income, we need to sit down and talk. We need to get on the phone with your CPA, with your tax attorney, and see if we could potentially be saving you up to 20% on your taxable income. Thanks for watching.